Hey everyone, welcome to another episode of Nerd Herders. My name is Rich. I'm uh, Dana. Nick. That's Dana and that's Nick. <laughs> Today we're playing another round of movie 20 questions where one of the three of us picks a movie Oops. and the other two have 20 questions to guess. So technically 19. Have to... <laughs> the show's falling apart. This might be our last episode. Um, today I have picked the movie. Picked the movie. I've picked the movie. Can you guys a guess of the movie that I'm gonna that I picked? The Godfather. Oh well, actually you can't do that unless you want to end the game because in the rules, <laughs> you can only guess the movie on the twentieth question, or if you guess it before then, mm. and you're wrong, mm. the game when is over. When you're right, you're right. I know. And you're right, right, right. And right, I'm like right, right like all right. like. So the whenever you guys want to begin, that's the first question. Okay, Richard, was this movie released prior to January first, uh, two thousand? No. Was this movie released prior to January 1st, 2010? Is that a good question? No. Oh. Was this movie released prior to January 1st, 2020? No, I'm just kidding. I don't count that. <laughs> I could. Um, all right, let's figure out something about the movie. Okay, it's in the last six years, right? It's in the last six years. Seven, no, I guess six still. Did this movie win any Academy Awards? No. Okay. Oh, that makes it hard. Genre? Yes. Does this movie have a... No. <laughs> Does this movie have a genre? <laughs> Go ahead. Is this movie a comedy? No. Mm. Action. Is this an action? Wait. Hmm. Yeah, action. Are this generally nominated for Academy Awards? No. So we would probably not just not want to ask like dramas because they usually are. Right. Right. Okay. Uh, is this movie an action movie? Yes. Hmm. Okay. Is this movie part of a franchise? Hmm. No. I wonder if it's like a spinoff type thing or like a. Mm. Now, when you said franchise, that was interesting you... that you said it like that. Did you mean so... like movie? Or yeah, here, like... let's go back. Define franchise. Sequels, prequels. No. Animated series, <laughs> spinoffs. The answer is no. Okay. So I wonder if it's re if it's like with like a book. Oh, maybe. Maybe. Or maybe. Something. maybe. Is this based on an existing property? Yes. So it could be like a book or like it a could video be a book, game. A video game, a comic. Mm -hmm. But nothing like no like. TV but it shouldn't show be anything. any Marvel movie, unless I mean even Guardians. I would consider I would consider something part of the franchise if it has a sequel coming out that we know about. That's rumored to be true. Um, Does that mean you want to change your answer? <sighs> Hold on. Wait, did you guess the movie? No, no, no. I think you just got it. <laughs> you didn't guess anything. <laughs> because, I mean, even if, even if it was Guardians, it does have some characters in there, specifically Thanos, that have been in other movies. So... See, this is where you guys get into trouble because you try to pick like all these like move like obscure movies, and then like you get into all these questions where you're like, eh, I'm eh, still eh, saying eh, no. Okay. Just pick like an easy right, movie. Let's figure out what it's based on. Okay, so he's still saying no. He's saying no. So I would assume it's not a Marvel movie because we just nah, had a deep conversation about that. It really wouldn't be that. any of the DC movies specifically either. Like it wouldn't be Batman v Superman or. Man of Steel. It could be something like a Watchman. Okay, so you want to find out what it's based on? Yeah. Okay. Go ahead. Uh, what do you think has better odds? Mm, probably, maybe a video game. But probably a book. That's what Some, I was thinking. Possibly a comic. Or should I specify? Yeah, no, just ask something. Uh, okay. Um, was this movie based on a book? Yes. Ding, ding, ding. A book. So it's based on a book. But it doesn't necessarily mean that the book came out in the last six years, right? 
No. Um, so what are some recent movies in the last six years that were based on books? That should be easy. Action That is also movies. action. My eyes can't turn like that. Um, is this movie fresh? Yes. Okay. Because there's not, I mean, there's not too many fresh one action action movies. Now, it could be something... What do you mean? I mean, there are, but a lot of times action movies are poorly reviewed. Huh. Fun um, fact. It could be something like a... Based on a book with action elements. Does this movie have sci-fi elements, too? Yes. Okay. How many I have an idea. I have. That's I have ten questions. Idea. Okay. You have an idea. Yes. Would you want to share it or no? Yes. Okay. <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm heavily leaning towards it being something like an Edge of Tomorrow. Okay. I don't know what that means. Um. I mean, you don't have to explain. Okay. Let me it just add. Is Tom Cruise in this movie? He is. I feel pretty good about that. So you think like that but, is the well, answer? I think that's the answer. Cuz a movie. Action movies that Tom Cruise was in in the last 6 years. 6 years that are not part of a franchise, so it's not Mission. Uh-huh. It's not um Jack Reacher. There's two of those. Um it's based on a book, a book that I know that he got <laughs> while we were at work. It's got sci-fi elements. It's well reviewed. Oh, he keeps some tabs on you, huh? Yeah. <laughs> is Emily sto- Blunt in this movie? Me, Nick? Yes, she is. It's twelve. Can I ask? <clears throat> yeah. Never mind. Go ahead. No, go ahead. Ask. We have. Plenty. Is that the name of the movie? Well, the, here's the thing. Okay. It was. What do you mean? The movie was called Edge of Tomorrow. Yeah. Oh, it could also be Oblivion, which is, but no, Emily Blunt. Okay. But um, uh, go on. but for some reason, on on when it came out on video, they called it Lindy Repeat. Okay, so <laughs> why don't we ask him? Is like if like in the movie title, is there the word tomorrow? Is that is that your question? Yeah. Okay. Well, you directed it towards Nick before you asked me. Yeah, but well, I turned and looked at you. It can be. <laughs> I need yes or no answers. <laughs> so, like, is this movie directed by Doug Lyman? Yes. So, is the answer to my question yes? It can. Be. The answer to your question is it can be. So, is he gonna like pull a fast one and we say one? He's gonna be like, nope, the other one. And then we say that one. And he's gonna be like, nope, the other one. So, <laughs> how about this? Because of the way that it is on the DVD, on the Blu-ray, right there. Is this movie oh. Live, Die, Repeat, Slash, Edge of Tomorrow? <laughs> it can be. It can be. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> I will never call it Live, Die, Repeat. Neither, I will always way. call it Edge of Tomorrow. That's so why did they change and it? Really, Nobody what it should knows. be called is what it was called. All You Need Is Kill? All You Need Is Kill. Yeah. Which is what the book is called and what the movie was called until very late in the process. And then they changed the title from the generic title they made to an even dumber title. To their tagline. To their tagline. Hmm. See, the, the franchise... But it's a fantastic movie. Oh, it's, it's... If you have not seen that, it's so good. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> what tripped me up is you're, you're like, oh, well, if there's a sequel coming out, there is a sequel in the works, but Rumor. it's not really filmed. So I was kind of like, eh, yeah. That's fair. That's fair. That, like if, if that Guardians, very likely might not ever happen. Yeah. Something like Guardians or with something John Wick or something, I would say, yeah, sure. Yeah. But that's so far out. Right. I would still that's say fair. no for now. That's fair. If, if we were to ever say, our, say the movie that we chose, because that was pretty short. If the movie that we chose was like, let's just say we chose Rogue One mm. and we asked if it had sequels, would you say yes? I think you'd have to. But it's kind of. But it goes kind of. It's part it of a franchise, but but it's not an episode. The episodes, I feel like, are But the see, sequels. this came into the same question that we had about like Marvel movies. They're part of a franchise, but... But, oh, but that's the that. thing. Or, or with if Kevin you don't Smith elaborate, or... If you don't elaborate, is it franchise? 
I would say yes. Just sequels. Is it sequels? No, there's no Rogue One 2. There's no Rogue 2. Yeah. Rogue That's yes. fair. Just for future reference. Rogue 2 Electric Boogaloo. Rogue, Rogue. Rogue. They Rogue save the They save the galaxy with dancing. Rogue 2. Wait, there's another Death Star? <laughs> Question mark? That's the next. It's going to be between Empire and Jedi. You know Jedi. what I was thinking about the other day? You know how, um, and this isn't exactly spoilers but they they give a reason for the dust start being able to be easily de- yeah destroyed why was star killer base easily destroyed maybe that's the next one that's rogue too yeah just saying that could be rogue anyway too. that's how you play tw- that could be rogue too i don't think they're gonna oh, what? I don't oh they got inside they of got them inside and they blew it up like, from the... like the second death star mm, that's right except for it was not incomplete yeah I don't know. Anyway, still agree. That's how we play movie twenty questions. Good job. Sweet. Uh, next week, I think I'll be picking the movie. It's your turn next week. So if you want to send me, was that an original submission? Yes, that was my own. I saw it sitting in here when I was setting up the uh, equipment. It is a dick pick. It is a dick pick. A true dick pick. Um, If you have a movie that you want me to choose, just uh, tweet at me. I match stonks. Um, You can tweet at her for her movie. I'm at Dana Explains. Or when it's my turn, you can tweet at me at Rich Belson or email me at overbeerofficial at gmail.com. Facebook is facebook.com slash overbeer. And, of course, youtube.com slash overbeer. Uh, that'll wrap things up for today. So until next time, drink up. <laughs>